Hello, Cancers, and welcome back to my channel, Luma Moon Tarot. So, Cancer, I am here late to give you guys your daily reading, okay? I've been led to take some time off for myself today, so I'm going to be putting out minimal readings today, okay? But I can't, I can't skip your readings, Cancer. You're my soul tribe. Um, so, and I'm really jazzed, Cancer, for this one because I found the baby, or the sister deck. I had misplaced the sister deck for 10 months. 10 months, you guys. And the divine led me straight to the sister deck last night. So I am super jazzed um, to have her again, you know, on the table. Anyway, Cancer, this reading is for the collective, so it may not resonate with all of you. Ooh, someone's angry here with you, Cancer. <laughs> Um, it may not resonate with all of you, my darling, so just take what resonates and leave the rest, okay? Then don't try to force it. And thank you so much, everyone, for all of your support. I love you. The likes, subscribes, comments, the love. You guys rock. Thank you so, so much for everything. All right, so yeah, Jubilatus, right? Look at that grumpy cat. Somebody's very angry and, oh, very angry and upset with you, Cancer. I feel like this is somebody that cannot come back in. Um, yeah, they're angry. You could have this person blocked or they're just in spiritual jail right now, really, is sort of what this looks like, getting their karma. They can't stop watching you, though. This is overindulgence. Whatever it is that you're putting out there, Cancer, you could be posting on social media, um, you could have your own platform, you could have a blog, you could, you know, whatever it is on social media, these people, they obsessively watch you. Like, it's literally all that they do. Whoever this, it could be one person, it could be a couple of different people here, but um, yeah, they're obsessively watching you. Um, somebody could be doing a lot of overeating or eating late at night too, just like junk food. And so be careful about that. I don't know if that's you or someone else. Look at this. Somebody wants to attack you here, Cancer. But I feel like the this attacks can't um, affect you anymore. Um, yeah, look, um, they want to really attack you, but they can't. Look at they know it. They know there's nothing they can do because the divine is protecting you, right? You are so divinely protected right now. Your energy isn't even out here, Cancer. I feel like the divine has control of this now. So this is about whoever this is. You know what I'm seeing is like people being corralled, okay? Okay. I'm seeing people in a corral, like um, the divine is rounding people up and giving them their karma, and any spiritual attacks that they're sending you are not working. They can, I don't even think they can come towards you. It's almost like they want to attack, but they can't. They're literally cowering when it comes to... Um, be you know like having the divine protect you they know that you're protected and i feel like that scares them yeah they know that you're protected here cancer yes that's the divine bus and the divine is in charge spirit is driving now and um whatever attacks that they sent to you are now coming back on them they're being they're being beat down this is a this is a beat down by the divine, okay? Yeah, it's something that you're putting online, something that you're saying, something that you're posting maybe um, that's got these people all up in a tizzy. I feel like you're just out here speaking the truth. You're happy. You're in the white light here. Um, I'm feeling light worker energy, Cancer. And they're obsessed. They're watching you. I feel like... Maybe you're even um, putting it out there that you're spiritually protected and divinely led. Like, um, I kind of get the sense it's freaking people out. It's making them angry. It's making them scared. Um, overindulging. Maybe it's making them paranoid. I'm feeling like a paranoia 
off of these people, whoever this is. It could be multiple people. Definitely a masculine energy who's upset. And they don't know how you're doing this. How do you know what you know? They, this is with the moon card here, Cancer. They have no idea how you would know this, okay? I feel like um, maybe you're telling, you're putting it out there on social media somehow, you know, um, that you're under spiritual attacks. You know people have been um, doing, you know, sending you bad energy. I feel like when they make a plan to attack you, Cancer, it's like you ruin the plan because you already know about it. You're, you're, it's almost like you're 10 steps ahead of these people. And, um, and the divine is giving you these messages. This is why they, they are in, like, um, overindulging watching you here. This is all they do is watch you. They plan. They watch you. They see that you already know about the plan. And then they get upset. They make another plan. You already know about it. Like They're like, how are you getting this information? And you're telling people, you're putting it out there. You're like, well, the divine's giving me this information. I don't know it. I don't know what you're talking about. You know what I mean? Um, they know, they realize you're spiritually led here. And you just keep giving these people like tower after tower, you and the divine both. Because um, you're, you're just so way ahead of them. You're literally 10 steps ahead of these people. I feel like they're trying to, they're making plans to ruin you here, Cancer, okay? They are, and I feel like these are people that you have done way too much for to begin, you know, to begin with. I feel like in the past, you would have done anything that you could for these people. You would have carried this boulder over and over and over again, and they just, you know what, they just kept um, giving you burden after burden, expecting you to carry the burdens, and yeah, you're not anymore, you, you freed yourself from that, you're out in the spotlight now, oh, you're, you're speaking about the things that people have done to you, and you're making them take a look at themselves, and they don't like what they're hearing, they don't like looking at themselves, Cancer, okay? But you're, you're in the spotlight here with it. And, and you're, you're like foiling all their plans. You're ruining their plans to um, spiritually attack you or anything that they want to do to you. You already know. So you're out here um, basically telling your story of how you were mistreated, used, um, taken advantage of. Yeah, look at this, man. People want to stop that. You're, you're causing so much chaos behind the scenes. You have no idea. And it's all because you're two steps or ten steps ahead of these people. And you're making them take a look at themselves. And they don't know how to stop it. And they can't stop watching you. Because it's such a mystery, you're in the spotlight, they watch you obsessively here. Maybe they should just stop watching what you're doing, Cancer. You know, it would bother them a whole lot less, right? I feel like, um, yeah, you are protected big time. You're, I feel like they, they know that you're abundant. They know that um, you've got the, you know, the, what's in this treasure box is your energy and where you can go with it. Okay, where you can take it, the, the heights that you can take this. It's abundance, it's, it's your abilities, it's your intuition. Everything is in this box, and look at how protected it is. They can't get to you, Cancer, especially since you're so, um, you're so intuitive. You know what these people are planning before they even go through with the plan, and that's why they can't stop watching you. It's like, how are you doing this? Yeah, look at you've got people behind the scenes talking about you completely enraged. Completely enraged. But yet they don't stop watching you because they find it fascinating. <laughs> yeah. Uh, there could be a group of three feminine energies that just plan, plot, against you cancer send you bad energy it's only coming back on them you are so protected 
so protected. Um, you could be working on a creative project here. Someone here could also be pregnant. Um, but I feel like this is just something creative that you're doing. So maybe you started your own project, um, creative endeavor, using your intuition and your abilities here. It's growing, expanding. You're being divinely led and protected. That's that. You're being divinely led to use your intuition, call people out, make them take a look at themselves, ruin their nasty little plans, okay? You're happy doing it. You're very good at it. This is, this is a, a lot of spiritual abilities right here, okay? You're telling your story, and you're being led to do it. You're making these people look at themselves, Okay, they're planning, plotting against you, Cancer, but all they have is a potato and a crayon. That plan's not going to go very far, all right, especially since they're up, really up against the divine. Okay, these people, it's almost like the divine is holding them away from you, but yet shining the light on you to expose them and show them the truth about themselves. And you're being led to do this. This is like a calling, and you've got, I mean, you've got so much spir spiritual protection here. It's crazy, okay? Yeah, look, I, I feel like you are in the spotlight. You are, you're, you've transformed your own life, and I feel like you are here to inspire others to transform their lives. But in order to do that, they need to take a look at themselves. So Cancer, you are being kind of used as an instrument by the divine right now with your abilities that you have and the way the divine has put you in the spotlight, you have the ability to make these people look at themselves. Okay? Because, you know, I feel like the divine is using using the light workers here because, you know, people, um, people aren't going to listen to the divine, but they'll listen to a like somebody here, a person, a human who's on the 3D, right? And I feel like that's what you're doing here. You're, that's your calling. So whatever it is that you're doing, you could be a writer. You don't have to have a platform. You could be a writer. You could write music. You could be a singer. You could be an artist. Um, you could just, be, it doesn't matter what you're doing, okay? I feel like you're making these people look at themselves and boy do they hate it they hate it cancer they want you out but yet at the same time they're obsessed with and fascinated with what you're doing um i feel like um man i think they would do anything that they could to ruin you and silence you but with you being 10 steps ahead of them and being spiritually led and protected there's really nothing they can do they have to look at themselves. They have to look at themselves. You know, or they could stop watching you, but at this point, they can't stop watching you either. All right, so what else can you show me here for cancer? Yeah, you are extremely intuitive, very tapped in, held in high regard by the divine with all of this protection and the calling that you've got going on here. Oof. I feel like, yeah, and you're, um, you're attracting new things to you here every day, Cancer. Yeah, here's the thing. I feel like you guys are kept um, in a safe place. Some of you could even be getting the messages that you may need to change locations away from these people, but the divine is keeping you safe. I feel like you're safe. Okay? I really do. And I feel like some of you... Um, maybe building or expanding here on whatever creative project you started. You could be looking at some fresh ideas, new options for um, ex like expansion. I'm seeing you um, working, building something new, still looking, you know, overlooking something that you've previously been. So you're growing. You're growing here. Um, in like with uh, people that want to listen to you, right? Um, followers, you could have a lot new. Uh, you're attracting 
people with your messages and your energy here. So more followers or more people who um, want to read your book or more people who want to listen to your music, more people who want to come and see your art, whatever it is that you're working on. Okay, it could be anything, right? Yeah, I feel like you're expanding and people are amazed. It's almost like you can't be stopped at this point, but they're being stopped and they're having to take a look at themselves. I feel like too, they've sent you a lot of bad energy cancer, but it's been transformed into um, positive things for you. Like um, y you may feel like you're more clear-headed now, making new plans. Your creative plans are starting to flow. Um, things are starting to come together for you here, Cancer. You're not only rebuilding, but you're expanding. Okay? Yep. Exposing a lot of things, too. Like, say you have, um, say you have a, a platform out here, right? You could be starting another channel or... You could be um, starting a different kind of blog or um, something here. I feel like, yeah, it's, yeah. You're leading a lot of people to you, Cancer, and you're making bank with whatever it is you're doing. You're inspiring so many, and I feel like you've got a lot of abundance coming to you. Now, this could also be sudden wealth. This is a sudden wealth card with the scales being balanced here. Yeah. So some of you are about to get sudden wealth. You're about to get a lot of popularity as far as people loving what you're doing and the messages that, you know, you're giving them meaningful messages to help guide them, okay? Yes, Cancer. It's like you're expanding and these people in the background that are just hating on you, they're falling. There's nothing they can do. They're being held back from you. This is like a wall of protection that the divine is put up, okay, to protect you so you can keep growing, so you can get the sudden wealth. Yeah. And meanwhile, they're just, they're so upset, Cancer, because honestly, they can't bring you down. You're 10 steps ahead, and you're protected. And they don't know how you're doing this. Like, for real. They have no idea. They're fascinated. They're hating on you, but they're still fascinated. Okay? I don't know how to describe it. Yeah. Here's the thing. These people that we're talking about from your past, when they sabotaged you, Cancer, they hurt themselves. And they're realizing that now. When they tried to destroy you, they actually destroyed themselves. Look at where he's cutting this branch. He's going to fall down too. You see that? So I feel like these people are now realizing that whatever they tried to do to you, the more hurt they got okay the more it damaged them um so yeah they're realizing that and you i feel like so they're they're seeing the damages they caused to themselves by hurting you you're giving that information out putting it out there in the spotlight right shining the light on everything making them see it the divine is putting up a wall so they can't attack you but yet at the same time, spirit wants you to continue to shed the light on things. And it's, it's making you expand. It's, making, it's um, bringing more people to you. And it's making you rich. And these people, I'm telling you, they are in a spiritual jail. They can't move. They have to look at what they've done. They have to see that in hurting you, they hurt themselves. In trying to ruin you, they ruin themselves. And now they're stuck because spirit is in charge, protecting you. You're being led. You're doing a job here. I feel like I'm talking to light workers, okay? 
but they're realizing this now and they have to stay where they are in a spiritual jail and take a look at themselves because I feel like they can't they can't get to you yep you've gotten clarity here they can't get to you they can't and I feel like in the in the meantime you're expanding and becoming wealthy and um, inspiring other people and you're just it's almost like your abilities have been heightened as well here cancer yeah you're in the ten of cups energy here living wish fulfillment you could possibly be going on a vacation your family looks happy here um you could be traveling just glowing you're on a major glow up here cancer and you're becoming very very wealthy this is generational wealth this is like the ten of pentacles and the ten of cups here you're you're about to live a wish fulfilled life and these people over here they get to watch and for the for the hurt they tried to cause you cancer and the bad energy they tried to cause you they're realizing it only got them stuck they only hurt themselves and meanwhile, they're absolutely obsessed with you. They can't stop watching what you're doing. It's crazy. It's crazy. Um, yeah, look, on the bottom of the deck, Ten of Swords, everything. They, and look, this is where these people are. The Nine of Swords, the Ten of Swords. Lose and sleep at night, unable to rest because they're obsessively watching you. You're exposing everything that they've done. They're having to take a look at that. Everything that they did to you, Cancer, has come back on them. And they are stuck with this energy. The divine won't let them budge. I'm telling you. And I feel like it's multiple people here. Multiple people that are sending you attacks. Um, yeah, look, and they obsessively watch you. They can't stop watching you, everything that I just said. They can't stop watching you here, Cancer. They're watching you on a glow up. They're watching you be um, like crazy intuitive, okay? And uh, like heavily, like extremely intuitive. It's, 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 um, they're in awe of this you know they're actually amazed by what you're doing and they're watching you become rich wealthy yeah, look at how burdened they are by what they're seeing I can't make it up but they've got to carry these burdens they can't they can't reach you anymore the divine isn't letting them near you you got a wall of protection around you okay or whoever I'm talking to and really you're not trying to hurt anybody but you are speaking your truth um, yeah look I feel like that's your intuition here cancer people don't know what to do you're knocking them way off balance here they don't know what to do um, yeah you may have a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn here, who, who's in love with you too. They, you're about to get communication from somebody. A big old whopping apology coming towards their empress here. So yeah, people are going to start coming back in now. Okay, to try to apologize here. They see you in the public eye, very intuitive, speaking your truth. Um, yeah, telling, telling people about their own toxic ways, I feel, is what this is. There could be somebody here who's very jealous, envious. Sorry, Cancer, my battery died. Yeah, somebody here is very envious, jealous of you, very toxic person. So, I mean, I feel like there's, there's a, an, an ex here that wants you back, that wants to apologize. I feel like... Um, there's a lot of people here that you're calling out on their BS, right? Putting it out there. I feel like there's a queen of swords energy who's jealous, envious of you, possibly in a toxic situation with this person who wants to apologize. 
they're watching you online and you know what all of these people who are trying to sabotage you behind the scenes cancer you've got nothing to do with them nothing but it's your intuition man then how are you knowing all that you know right how are you able to see what what plans they have for you behind the scenes right like i said you're 10 steps ahead of them these are people that are getting frustrated angry um you've got um a, i feel a masculine energy that's fallen to pieces um because you're making them look at how they treated you you know uh you're calling people out on their bs cancer and they can't stand it and they can't stop you and they can't stop watching you because you're absolutely correct And I feel like the, none of these people, you're not around them anymore. These are people that um, you've cut out of your life already. These are past people here. And I feel like, like I said, these people are being shown things about themselves. The divine has put you in the public eye to make these people look at themselves. Okay? And they hate it. And anything they're planning against you, Cancer, you are 10 steps ahead. I, I feel like, too, um, some people in the, in the past, they're having to take a look at their own issues here. Okay, their face is planted in all of these burdens. That's the stuff that they've done. And I feel like um, all of the heartache and betrayal and the tears that they caused you, Cancer, I feel like it's coming back on them. They're having to take a look at um, their nasty ways and the things that they've done. And I feel like it's all coming back on them now. I kid you not. Your intuition, your abilities, your spiritual ability, abilities, they don't know what to do with this. They don't know how to stop it. They don't want to look at themselves. Some of these people are even embarrassed um, in their community because of what they've done to you. Okay, there's a lot of different scenarios. So whatever truth you're putting out there and whatever intuitive messages that you're picking up on, you're right. You're spot on correct, Cancer. And these people, they don't know how you're doing it. They don't know how to stop it. They don't know how to stop watching you because they're absolutely amazed. Like they don't know what to do. And you just keep on winning because you're 10 steps ahead of these people okay yeah anyway cancer um that's what i have for this reading cancer i honestly i'm trying to take the day off so i'm i'm just gonna stop it here right um but yeah i love you cancer i think um I think you're amazing too these people don't know what to think they don't know what to do there's nothing they can do there's nothing they can do, Cancer. You are so, so intensely spiritually protected right now. Just know that. Anyway, my darlings, that's what I have for this reading. I do hope this helps. I hope it resonates. I hope you guys have a great day today. Get outside. Do something fun. Clear your head, right? Go and play, Cancer. <laughs> Anyway, my darlings, um, if you like this video, please click that like button, right? Subscribe to my channel if you like this vibe. And until next time, everyone, take care of you and peace out.